Hey everyone! Welcome back to our YouTube channel. Today, we're going to dive into some juicy celebrity news that has been making the rounds, the alleged drama between Oprah Winfrey and her partner Stedman Graham. If you are new to our channel, support by subscribing and don't forget to hit the notification button for more updates. Now, for those of you who might not be familiar with the details, the buzz is that Stedman Graham, Oprah's longtime partner of over 30 years, has apparently been pushing for a divorce. And according to multiple reports, Oprah has been steadfast in her refusal to grant him that request. This has apparently been an ongoing issue for some time, with Stedman supposedly growing increasingly frustrated with Oprah's unwillingness to make their relationship more official through marriage. But Oprah, being the savvy businesswoman that she is, has allegedly been digging her heels in and refusing to cave to his demands. To provide a bit of context, Oprah and Stedman first met back in the 1980s and have been a couple ever since. However, they've never actually tied the knot, with Oprah famously stating over the years that she has no plans to get married. This has led to plenty of speculation and rumors about the true nature of their relationship over the decades. Some have even suggested that it's more of a business partnership than a romantic one, with Stedman allegedly content to play the role of Oprah's partner in the public eye while she maintains full control over her empire. But now, it seems Stedman may have reached his breaking point. According to the reports, he's been pushing Oprah hard to agree to a divorce settlement that would grant him a significant portion of her massive wealth and assets. Apparently, Stedman is arguing that after being by Oprah's side for over 30 years, he's entitled to a sizable chunk of her $3.5 billion fortune. Estimates suggest he's demanding anywhere from $500 million to $1 billion as part of the divorce proceedings. Dot sources close to the media mogul claim that she's made it crystal clear to Stedman that she has no intention of handing over that kind of money, even if it means ending their relationship. Oprah reportedly believes that Stedman's claims of entitlement are unfounded, given that they were never actually married. She's allegedly told him in no uncertain terms that he has no legal or moral right to a massive payout, and that she's prepared to duke it out in court if necessary. The implications of this potential divorce battle could be huge, both for Oprah and Stedman personally, as well as the broader entertainment industry. For one, a very public and acrimonious split between these two highly influential figures could seriously damage both of their reputations. It could also have major ripple effects on Oprah's media empire, as well as Stedman's own business ventures and public profile. There's also the question of how this might impact Oprah's philanthropic work and charitable giving. If she's forced to part with a significant portion of her wealth in a divorce settlement, that could seriously hamper her ability to continue supporting the causes and communities she cares about. Needless to say, this is a developing story that's sure to keep the rumor mill churning for some time. We'll have to wait and see whether Oprah and Stedman are able to reach some kind of amicable resolution or if this heads to an all-out legal battle. In the meantime, I'd love to hear your thoughts on all of this. Do you think Oprah is right to stand her ground, or should she cut Stedman a bigger slice of her pie? All right, you all clearly want to know more about this developing situation between Oprah Winfrey and Stedman Graham, so let's dive in a little deeper. As I mentioned earlier, Oprah Winfrey is an absolute powerhouse when it comes to her business empire and net worth. She's built a media and entertainment juggernaut over the past few decades, with her iconic talk show, magazine, TV network, and numerous other ventures. Estimates put Oprah's current net worth at around $3.5 billion, making her one of the wealthiest celebrities in the world. This wealth comes not just from her media work, but also from savvy investments, real estate holdings, and a diverse portfolio of other business interests. Given the sheer scale of Oprah's empire and assets, it's easy to see why Stedman might feel entitled to a substantial payout in a potential divorce. After all, he's been by her side through it all for over 30 years. Now, the tricky part is determining exactly what Stedman's contributions have been to Oprah's success over the years. By all accounts, he's played more of a supportive, behind-the-scenes role, rather than being directly involved in the day-to-day -day operations of her businesses. Some reports suggest that Stedman has provided valuable counsel and advice to Oprah over the years, helping to guide some of her major strategic decisions. He's also been a constant, loyal companion, accompanying her to events and supporting her through both personal and professional challenges. 
However, critics argue that Stedman's role has been more symbolic than substantive and that he doesn't have a legitimate legal claim to a massive payout, especially given that they were never officially married. And therein lies the crux of the issue, the legal landscape surrounding unmarried couples and their assets is murky at best. In most jurisdictions, there is no automatic right to an equitable division of assets in the event of a split unless there is a prenuptial or cohabitation agreement in place. Oprah and Stedman reportedly never had any such formal agreement, which means Stedman may have an uphill battle if he tries to take this to court. Lawyers have suggested that he'd have to prove he made significant, direct contributions to Oprah's business ventures in order to have a strong case for a substantial payout. So, what might the potential outcomes be if this does end up in a protracted legal battle? Well, it's hard to say for sure, but a few possibilities come to mind. Oprah and Stedman could reach some kind of private, out-of-court settlement that avoids a very public and messy divorce proceeding. The courts could side with Oprah, ruling that Stedman has no legal entitlement to a huge chunk of her wealth, given the nature of their relationship. Stedman could potentially win a smaller, more symbolic payout, just to appease his demands and avoid further litigation. Whichever way it goes, the fallout from this saga is sure to be widespread. Oprah's reputation and brand could take a hit, and her ability to continue her philanthropic work could be jeopardized. And Stedman's own public profile and future prospects could also be severely damaged, depending on how this all plays out. Needless to say, this is a complex and high-stakes situation that bears close watching in the weeks and months ahead. I'll be sure to keep you all updated as any new developments emerge. In the meantime, I'd love to hear your thoughts. Do you think Oprah is in the right here, or should she be more willing to compromise with Stedman? Let me know your take in the comments below. And if you found this video informative, be sure to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. That way, you'll be the first to know when we have more updates on this juicy celebrity saga. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Take care.